And so we reach the final qualification lap. It is so crucial for those looking to take the club to the next level. A step closer to being a part of the big business. A big performance, that's what's needed here. And the loyal following is assembled, doing its best to be the wind beneath their wings. And the match day noise at this place is truly special. The pride, the passion, it adds to a massive sense of occasion. If you're just joining us, we are already on the way. An early chance there, first of the game. Yeah, he's disappointed with himself, but at least his boss is applauding the effort he made. Well, he's felt that, hasn't he? Well, nicely intercepted. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Robert Lewandowski. He's just about the perfect all-round striker. Not least because he can finish equally well with both feet, Peter. It's not all about his finishing, though. He's had a shot! It's there! Well, talk about a real rude awakening. It's almost as if the defence saw nothing coming. They just didn't anticipate on heels rather than toes. Oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. Barcelona trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Araujo. Isco. That was good pressing. Forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. That's a shade optimistic. Barcelona are already trailing. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. So, is it really plausible to have a hit from here? That was travelling. Goulet, Bellingham, the ball is loose and the chase is on. Not the most accurate pass. Barcelona really can't go chasing this game too soon. Any rash decisions now could see them lose it. Oh, well played, he needed to get that right. That's oh, great defensive work, it doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Well, I appreciate the fact he's trying to make a difference, and if he carries on like that, he may well do. Isco and Kunde. He's a shot at the ball. Oh, shooting chance! And it's Lewandowski. Oh, that's a key interception. Nicely spread. Yamal fiddles it through. Eder Militao shakes the shoot. Oh, surely that deserved better. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Well, the referee's pulled play back and has booked him for the original offence. Promising, but the final ball is just not quite right. And that has left him in a heap. Barcelona have a free kick. It's a straight red. He has been given his marching orders. Madrid are down to ten men. Romeu. Pedri. Driving on and making good progress. This might spell danger. Lewandowski! Now, who's going to be first to this? He's got the goal! And that certainly packed a punch. 
Goulet. Oh, good to turn. Oh, it's been intercepted. He's beaten. He's one on one. There's the shot. A wonderful effort, all by himself. He's the one player you want on the ball running at defences, and that's precisely why. And he's on a charge. Well, it's a move of great promise, but will it really prove productive? Well, I'll do less said about that pass, the better. It's a quick ball upfield. Barcelona certainly could do with a positive spell for the remainder of this half, just to set the tone for what's to come. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. <laughs> Romeu. Pedri. Pedri! Oh, another save. Pedri clearly thought he'd done enough. The save was like a bolt from the blue. He is through here. Vinicius Junior. Well timed, excellent interception. Vinicius Junior! Now he wants to get in on the act here. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but uh, they've got to make it count. Spread it left. Interesting ball. A well played. That has snuffed out the danger. Rudiger. Kamavinga. And it's Tony Kroos. Lamine Yamal really added the width there thanks to his willingness to make the run. Pedri. And we've reached half-time. Oh, it's a half which has uh, simmered along nicely, warming up to what may be a more open second half to follow. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. Uh, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. So we're already into the second period. I think they've got to go out at the start of this second half now and set a tone that smacks of intent and determination. Should they manage it, I think they can find a way back. Good spot, he's seen the run. Is there any support? He might not need it. It's run loose, who's going to get there? Oh, he's, well, he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. The referee's come over. It's a red card. Well, he stayed down and is in very obvious discomfort here. Well, they are now a nine-man team. João Cancelo. And Araujo. Isco. Great ball if he can get there. And the flag has stayed down. And it's Romeu. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. <laughs> oh, he's hit the bar! Decent hit from there. Ede Militao, here's Chormeni, forwards and with intent, he's picked his way through. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Kunde. 
Isco. Araujo. And it's Cancelo. Now that looks a decent ball. Gets into some space. He ball! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, we were anticipating this. They're very much set up for the counter attack, and I don't see it changing anytime soon. Alaba does really well there. He is strong. Guler. Now that's well seen too. How many interceptions have we seen now? Someone's got to up the quality and, and set an example. Big chance to get at them. Now it's Joao Felix. This is promising. Oh, that's fabulous. Barcelona are definitely going about this the right way. This is a really front-footed approach. You know, the interest value in this game might just take off from here. And that's another good win of the ball. And the shot! All denied brilliantly! He's definitely living up to the occasion here. He just loves being out there amongst it. And we have our very first corner. Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Rudiger is there, and he can pick it up. Guler. Guler really needed to concentrate on protecting the ball. Then again, he was being very closely marshalled. Played into space out wide. Gavi. Oh, he's seen that early. He used a certain sixth sense. Barcelona appear determined to play through the middle again. And guess what? It's the same result. Barcelona perhaps contemplating their next change here. Yeah, and I think if you're looking for change in a tight game like this, Peter, it's all about getting the timing right. Well, there's plenty to like about this approach. Get your head down, keep battling away, and eventually things might change for you. Spread neatly. That's a throw. He's tried one! Well, now it's a race for the ball. Shot a goal! And the follow-up! And he's managed to get rid. Now, who's going to be first to this? A lot of space here, a real opportunity. And he cuts out the supply. That has been cut short. Gavi. Whatever happens, that's the kind of movement which raises hope. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Just five minutes remaining now. Well, that was a period of possession which carried just about no threat at all. Stood up well to him there. Pass somewhat off target. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Goulet might want to be careful there. It's a good foot in there. Eder Militao. And Gula. Four added minutes on the board.
And here's Lewandowski. He might be in here. Oh, he's got that all wrong, and it's a penalty. And that is a huge moment in the context of the game. Real pressure penalty, this. A formality, we're level. Not a twitch, not a blink. Well, that looked a simple case of giving the keeper the eyes and just slipping the ball to the other side. That was clever. So, 90 minutes up, and we will be back for extra time. Well, I think many on that pitch were ready for the final whistle to come, so let's hope that there's still plenty of energy about. Well, fitness and fatigue, the key factors now as we head for extra time. Se va a producir un cambio de jugadores. El dorsal 18 será reemplazado por el dorsal 15. 90 minutes gone and nothing between them still. Barcelona displayed great character to force extra time from what looked a pretty ominous situation. The question now is can they go on to win it? It is doable. Romeu. Aimed beyond the defence. Oh, look at the space here. Ferran Torres! He's looking wide. Goulet threads one in. Now it's Vinicius Junior. And he's managed to get free. He hits one! A real chance and a real let-off. Yeah, that was a fantastic run and it showed how brilliantly energetic he is. Alaba picks it up from the goal kick. Rudiger kept aware, and it is reclaimed easily. He could be in here, and he was quick to react. Oh, well played, well sorted out. It's a really well-measured ball, and they can counter here. Oh, that's well spotted. João Cancelo. He's looking to set free a runner. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Great, he's having a go. Oh, that's a waste. Kamavinga. He's found the way through. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. He's had a fair tumble under that challenge. Close. Can he finish? It's loose now and they want to get it back. Half time, extra time. Yeah, 90 minutes long gone, 15 of an extra 30 have also gone, and the search for a winner is still on. Truly, this is a punishing game on bodies and heads and minds. The outstanding question, the only question, is there still room for one last bit of drama? The hostilities have already resumed. This really has been thrilling. Both sides going at it, and now for the final act. He's onside. Vinicius Junior. Well, that tackle was certainly sturdy. Barcelona do have a chance to counter here. Goes back. Araujo. And it's Cancelo. Decent hit! And that's a real chance missed. Or maybe the tension around this game played a part in that because he should have put them ahead then.
And now they can spring out of defence. Challenge just a bit on the firm side. Kamavinga. It's the sort of situation that they'll want to capitalise on now. Sergio Roberto picks it up out wide. Cleared without hesitation. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Gets his pass away. Eder Militao. Distributed tidily. That is good alertness. The final whistle and confirmation we are headed for penalties. Look, I've been in this position myself, and after a grueling game, you don't want to back down if the manager asks you to take a penalty for fear of appearing weak. Uh, you can't let fatigue cloud your judgment. Pressure and nerve. After two inconclusive hours, it is penalties. Goulet is over the first kick. One nil. I thought he did really well to hold his nerve then and score that penalty. Ferran Torres steps up for his penalty. Cooley done, one each. Always a little more pressure when you're trailing, but it didn't show. Vinicius Junior is the second man to step up for his team. Denied remarkably. Oh, that's a super save from the keeper. So, the second man in line. Oh, no, it's a tame miss. And stepping up, the skipper. Keeper's gone the wrong way. Looks like he's done it a thousand times. Never looked like missing. The third man in the queue. Oh, he's hit the upright. It's a brave attempt, but he really should be getting it on target. Madrid are putting real pressure on here if they put this away. corner and they're two up calmly he puts the ball down on the spot the margin of error is zero Barcelona are beaten and they are out. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Well, what can I say, Peter? It seemed like the enormity of the task.